Hello and welcome to this plan with me video. This week I'll be doing some of my July weekly layouts that I've set up in my bullet journal. Per usual, I've sketched out all of my spreads in pencil in advance and will be erasing it once I'm done. For my second week of July, I'm going to do another horizontal layout, but modify some aspects of last week's layout based on how it went. I'm going to be using a seaweed design to separate my days, so I'm using my Princeton Neptune number no. 10 round brush and some Cascade Green from Daniel Smith. You could also create this design with a round brush by altering the pressure you use when you create the leaves. I also added my ocean surface using my Princeton number no. 12 brush and my Thalo Blue from Daniel Smith. To letter my days of the week, I used my Pentel Sign Brush Pen in grey, and I also used this to letter tasks in my next week section. Add the numbers of my days, I used my Uniball Signo white gel pen. I've also split up these horizontal sections vertically to add a section for events, AM and PM tasks. I found it really helpful for me to try to plan when I'm going to do a task and to see if it's feasible or not. For my third week of July, I'm going back to a vertical layout and I decided to do seashell drawings for my headers. Before painting, I'm just lightly taking my needleball eraser and erasing some of the lines because once you paint over it with watercolor or use a brush pen over top, it's going to be really difficult to get those pencil sketches lines out. I'm mainly using Daniel Smith's Buff Titanium for these shells, but you could use any earth tone or colors. Uh, shells come in a lot of varieties, so you can definitely personalize this to what you want on your spread. I also tried to do a different shaped shell for each.
I also added my ocean surface in thalo blue, but I would say in this case it's a bit more of a beach shoreline. To separate my sections, I'm using a Staedtler fine liner in Delft blue and just a ruler I got on Amazon. I also used my light gray Staedtler fine liner to create horizontal segments for events, AM and PM tasks. I also used my Pentel Sign brush pen again to add tasks and next week headers. To add some depth to my shells, I just went back with buff titanium mixed with a bit of conacodone rust, also from Daniel Smith, and just added some shadows. Once the shells had a chance to dry, I went back with my Pentel Sign Brush Pen and added the days and the dates. Here's a quick flip through of how my July is filling out so far. I've really enjoyed filling out this gratitude log and mood tracker this month. If you'd like to see what layout I will be doing for the final week of July, you can head over to my Instagram, Blue Creek Print Shop, and I will be posting it there. July is also World Watercolor Month, and I've been posting daily from a couple prompt lists. I will also be posting new products next week to my Etsy store, so stay tuned to my Instagram for information on that release. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.